What is up everyone, this is Mo Gaming here and today I'm going to show you how to fix the Valorant error code 62 so let's get right into this. So there's a couple of things that you can do to fix this error code and we're going <laughs> to get right into a few things that you can do essentially fix this. The first thing is if there's an actual update available that might be why this is happening so basically go into Riot Client, click into Valorant, it'll literally say update there, update the game right? If obviously you've already went through the basic step of doing that let's move on to the other steps that can help you basically fix this error so one of the next things you want to do is you want to basically go into your task manager and anywhere where it says riot client or valorant turn on you want to right click into it and end the task completely from here then you want to essentially search for something called services you see these two cogs pop up and you want to write vgc you want this pop up and you want to right click into this go into properties you want to change this from manual to automatic and then press start and apply. You always want to have this on automatic and you always want this status as running. Then basically uh, run Valorant or Riot Client and then Valorant from there, either or, and then essentially go from there. That should fix your issue. If not, the next thing you can do is you want to search for network connections. Uh, basically what you see over here and you want to find whatever you're connected to so I'm connected via Ethernet but if you're connected via Wi-Fi that's fine same thing right click into it go to where it says internet protocol version <coughs> excuse me version 4 uh, IPv4 and you want to change yours is going to say obtain DNS server address automatically to use the following DNS server address you want to change preferred to 8.8.8.8 and alternate to 8.8.4.4 this is Google's DNS server see whatever ones works best for you and go from there uh, after doing this, you sh you can try and see if this fixes it for you. If not, the other thing you can do is you can run CMD as administrator. And in here, you can do ipconfig, if I can spell it right, slash flush DNS. And then this is going to successfully flush the DNS resolver cache. And then pretty much either restart your computer and try or just try and you should be good to go. So yeah, that's basically it. If you guys are like this video, please smash that like button. If you guys are new to the channel, make sure to subscribe, hit that notification bell, and I'm gonna go. Peace.